Hello everyone, this is ASMR Studio welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorial and tutorial show you the logo making tutorials that means the signature logo if you are the fashion photographer then and this tutorial is for you guys so let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell again for the new notifications go to the file options and take a new and I'll take a canvas which is 2560 and 1440 and the pixel 200 pixel per inch and hit the create button and I'll give you a download link and you'll get a zip folder and after unzip this one you are getting these fonts and those font I will set it up and right press and install and hit the ok button and I already just installed it and that's why it's just showing me like that so that's good and then just go to the photoshop back and go to the file and place embedded options and from here i'll just insert this photo i downloaded this photo from the pixels.com and i'll give you that download link in my video description now go to the adjustment layer and solid color take a black color and make the opacity down a little bit yeah that's fine and now go to the text tool and just select once and make the font size bigger and i'll write down and select all the things and go to the character options if you want to get the character options here go to the window and character from here so I'll change the font the name of the font was the penny then I'll just go right down and you can sort out like uh, here is the options and you can make it a script font and you'll get this one and hit the tick button press ctrl T and make it a little bit smaller yeah and here is the glyphics options that means the extra line and other steps are called the glyphics so select the a options you'll get some glyphics over here so you can choose from here like this so that's fine or this one is good this so i'll select this one yeah that's good and hit the tick button and press ctrl t and make it small a little bit and reposition this one in the middle of the photo that's good and i'll write down the photograph with that things so i'll just go to the text tool again and change the font type and go to the all class options and i'll select this one next up bold and select once nexa font and from the character options increase the space between two letters and you can increase the font size 16 that's good and i'll make it all caps from here so i'll move this one here photography and select this font right press and just restylize the type and i'll take the rectangular marquee tool cut it down so that's good and nice logo select these two things make it group and if you want to export this one turn off all the things and go to the file and save as options here and save it like png format and save it and hit ok how to like replace or place this one in your photography go to the file and open up suppose i have a photo i got this photo from suppose this photo yeah this photo i want to place that logo in this photography so go to the file again and place embedded i exported that png file and hit the place options and make it bigger like that and just like this and if you want to change the color right press and blending options from here the color overlay and from here choose a color like black that's good or ash 
or yellow whatever you want what kind of color you want to just i am selecting this one or black is good and hit ok if you need you can change the opacity from here reduce the opacity a little bit it will be a nice signature and it will place uh, in your photography hope that you learn a lot from this tutorial if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and all the resource file the font download link and photo download link in my video descriptions please check it out and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon until the next video i am ac signing out today and bye bye